peanut butter pie next on Tim Palmer's Country Kitchen, because the grandbabies are here. They say you are what you eat, so I don't eat chicken feet. But I love me some of Grandma's pickled beets. Well, cut it up, put it in the pan, throw it over your shoulder and see where it lands right here in the farmer's kitchen. Maters, taters, beans and corn, the cows in the barn and the sheep's been shorn, kids in the barnyard chasing grandpa's chicken. chicken, chicken. Spices, slices, cuts and dices, gonna slash your grocery prices right here in the farmer's kitchen. Help you grow your garden good with recipes to suit your mood. Try some grub you've never tried before. Smash it with a wooden mallet, gonna educate your palate. Right here in Farmer's Kitchen, in Tim Farmer's Country Kitchen. We're gonna cook something good now. Hello and welcome to Tim Farmer's Country Kitchen. We have a great show for you today. You know what? We're going to take the grandbabies tonight and we're going to cook a recipe, one of which was their great, great grandmothers. We had a whole lot of fun in the kitchen. We didn't tear anything up, but with no further ado, here are the grandbabies and a couple of recipes to keep those traditions alive. Hello, it's Tim Farmer's Country Kitchen. I'm Natalie and this is my little sister, Taryn. Well, how about that? It is Tim Farmer's Country Kitchen and these are our granddaughters and you probably haven't seen them for a while. Now, what are we making tonight? Peanut butter pie. Peanut, Peanut butter, butter, butter pie. pie. You know what? This is Grandma Calacarinas' recipe right. who had a restaurant in Pennsylvania. That's right. Now, she was a heck of a cook by all accounts and so was her husband. You know what? I love recipes that are taken down from generation to generation. This is almost like it's got a custard and middle peanut butter on the top. And we're going to do one extra thing to it just to see Ooh, how it What are we going to do? I can't tell you. Okay, it's a secret. But you know what? Generally, when the grandkids are here, we kind of do things backwards. Sometimes we have dessert first. Yum. Don't tell your mom. Yeah, don't tell your mom. So anyhow, we're going to start making this first. But what for dinner, we're having chicken and dumplings. We love chicken and dumplings. Now we're gonna borrow our I'm recipe. I'm hungry. I'm starving. We're gonna borrow this recipe from Judy Sweeney. Tonight it's chicken. Now we've already boiled our chicken and just enough to get it off the bone. We pulled it off the bone, but we saved our stock. Yum. Very important. Yummy. Now back to the peanut butter pie from Grandma Calacarinas. And we have this in our cookbook. It's on page 30 in the cookbook. Page 30. Tell me how you would fix the peanut butter pie. Peanut butter, right? Flour and sugar. And then and would you put it in a pan and heat it up for how long? Uh, 50 minutes. 50 minutes, then put it, put it in the oven at what temperature? Mm, 60. 60, probably 60. Okay. You know what, if we do that. I think all the ones right. Hmm? Yeah, that's it's amazing. She's right, that's she's amazing. smart. amazing. So let's, let's mix it and cook it for 50 minutes and put it in the oven for 60 degrees. <laughs> Natalie stirs and you're the pour. That's our, we're gonna start with two cups of milk. Two cups of milk, put Can it you in pour there. it in there and be very careful. Corn starch. That's going to thicken that up. One. Real easy. Two. Now, obviously, this is going to have to be stirred. Three. That's Natalie's job. All right. All right, Papa. Next, we need eggs. Three eggs. Three eggs. What? All right. Let's let's bring them. Three eggs, and we're going to separate okay. them. Though I'll do this part, so we don't mess. We're going to okay, keep. Okay, we're separating because we want to keep the egg whites for later. That's amazing how you do that, Grandma. I know. There's one. Just putting the just putting the yellow part of the egg in. That's gross. right. Just the yolk. Two. Be careful. Now we're saving the whites for later, right? We're gonna mix those up and put that in our pie, that's right. Okay. Okay, three. Start whisking it. There's a quarter teaspoon of salt. All right, here's something Taryn can put in. Here's half a cup of sugar. You wanna pour that in for us? I pour all of it. Yep, yep. pour all that in. Be real careful, don't spill it. I know. All right. Don't drop it pour in. Pour it in. Got it? There we go. Yippee. Perfect. Got her done. Now, oh, that was wonderful. Right. We're going to stir that in how long until it starts sticking Till it up? Gets thick. It takes a little bit of while, so we can just sit here. We're going to set off to the side. Right. All right, that is looking perfect. It's getting nice and thick. It looks almost like custard, doesn't it? Yum. It tastes good, too. All right, at this point, Grandma, you add your vanilla. How much? We're going to add a teaspoon of vanilla. That's we're going to set this aside. Good job, Nailey. All right. And we're going to set this aside, and we're going to get our peanut butter mixture ready. You know, I heard somebody say one time that you are what you eat, so I don't eat chicken feet. But I love me some of Grandma's pickled feet. So cut it up. Put it in a pan, mm -hmm. throw it over your shoulder, and see where it lands. Right here in Farmer's Kitchen. Right here in Farmer's Kitchen. Farmer's kitchen. Country kitchen. That's, my, that's my babies right there. All right, now we have cheated just a little bit. 
because we want to get this thing done as soon as possible. We got our own graham cracker crust. We bought we bought it. Yeah, anyway. that's okay, Papa. You but can buy it. Now, we get to the good part, the peanut butter, confectioner sugar. Half a cup of sugar, this powdered no sugar, fire. and half a cup of peanut butter. So you want to pour this in very yes, careful. Please. And Nailie, you want to pour this one and we'll scoop it. Go ahead and pour both those in. This is the messy part, Papa. All right, confectioner sugar and peanut it. butter. All right, so we're going to make this into kind of almost like a paste here. Get your fingers in there. Try not to get messy. Get it all good. There you go. Make it into like, yeah. Good job. That's beautiful. That's all sounding good. So let's get, we want to take, let's just take the crumbly parts and put it in the bottom of the pie. So you girls, let's keep the thick part. We'll put it later. Take those crumbly, sprinkle them real nicely in there. Yeah, we're just sprinkling it. One little it. layer. Perfect. Look how good bottom. that looks. We're all helping. Yeah, How's that look, Papa? It looks very good. All right, now we're going to get our cream sauce that we made with the milk. Okay. Is it cooled down a little bit? And we're going to pour that in. I'm going to grab oh. it. Oh. What is that? Mm -hmm. That's our cream sauce. All right, Papa, if you want to smooth that out for us. Mm -hmm. Now, what did you say we cooked this at, Taryn? 60 degrees? Uh, yeah. For how long? I would say 20. 20? I think you're about right. right. And remember those egg whites we saved? Mm -hmm. We're going to just put a layer of that on here. All right, we're going to add that egg. And you know what, Papa? Let's add a little sugar to that. Now, we're going to move our pie forward. There's a little flour. And you could you could crumble it on too, but I think we're going to make ours. We're going to roll ours out. Right. Papa, you want to roll it? You're a good roller. I'll roll it out. Papa's a good roller. Now, we're going to try to make this about the surface size. All right, let's just take our pieces, parts and pieces, and spread them around here on the top. Can I help? There we go. Ooh, look at that. And that's it, Papa. Absolutely. So let's put that in the oven. Grandma, where's I'm gonna the... I'm going to grab it. Now that peanut butter part is going to melt into that and come out being all nice. And that's and at 400 degrees. Okay, while she's licking the spoon and Taryn's cleaning up the peanut butter, we're going to let that go for about 20 minutes until yeah. it gets brown on top. About 400. Just yeah. Now that's going to firm up like it's going to, mm. Mm. it's just going to be. And yummy. then you're going to put your secret on top. All right, remember the surprise I told you? Mm -hmm. You see where I'm going here? Mm -hmm. We're already decadent. I mean, that's already gonna be delicious, but whenever I have peanut butter, I'm gonna get me some dark melting chocolate wafers, which we're gonna take and we're gonna melt. Do these girls like chocolate though? Oh, they hate chocolate. They hate so chocolate. I'm probably gonna have to eat most of this pie myself. I'm gonna eat it. Oh, you wanna eat it too? Okay, we might give you a little bit. But the deal is, chocolate? Chocolate and peanut butter. What's that remind you of? Reese's. So if that's already delicious, what happens when you put chocolate on top? Um, it looks like Reese's. It's like, oh my, I can't hardly wait. So this kind of chocolate right here that Ooh. you make for candies, that's going to harden up on the top once that cools down. This is going to be so terrible, the chocolate and the peanut butter, that I'm probably going to have to eat all yeah, of the, it. Yeah, the girls won't want this. They no, hate the chocolate. Do you guys chocolate hate chocolate? chocolate? No. no you we love, love chocolate. Oh, wait a minute. I thought you hated it. Can I, can I lick Why this would you spoon? want to lick the spoon if you hate chocolate? Yeah. Nobody I likes chocolate. Cho I love chocolate. Oh, you love chocolate? Oh, Yum. it's getting there. We're going to have to eat this, Papa. Yeah, I we're probably going to have to eat it. You can't take it anymore? Let's put a little bit more in there. Oh, my goodness. We got plenty of chocolate. Can I touch it? I'm going to have a chocolate coma. Yeah. Can't anything. We haven't had dinner yet. You're, if your mother sees this, she'll kill us. Don't let her mother see yeah, this. Yeah, so our mom's not going to see it. I'm gonna she is going to see it. it. I'm going to tell her. her. <laughs> yes, I want you guys to get in trouble. I want you to get to think that I really want to see that. Then we're gonna let that set and cool down. While that's cooling down, we're gonna fix our din din, which doesn't take long. It's a quick dinner. Yummy. Oh, we got chocolate on our peanut butter. Oh my goodness. And vice versa. Ooh. That's not gonna be good. Nobody will wanna eat that. I will. I wanna eat Nobody it. Nobody will wanna eat that. There. Papa, may I please eat it? No, oh, that looks terrible. <laughs> oh. Papa, we're gonna have to spank your butt if you don't let us eat that, right, Grandma? No, with that metal me. spoon. Oh my goodness, now that looks there. delicious. Now we're gonna take it. Ooh. Spread it out over to the edges. Papa. And that's going to be just like the surface of a Reese's cup. Oh, look <laughs> how beautiful that is. Papa, is Papa just joking? He's just joking. Too bad. We'll eat it. We'll tear it apart. Mm -hmm. Is it fancy? Oh, my it looks like an angel.